right at our back. So we're where the elk we think are straight in front of us over there. We drove around trying to look, see if we can see this morning. Got bird hunters out here too, so that pickup behind us. swirling down below we took a, another ride about a mile down and it's coming from a different direction so we may blow them out but we'll do some blasting here see if we can find them shooting a killer inch this next one shoots at four feet five feet per second nice and compact bow here and we just sat down glass in this meadow we got a, a bull bugling out there there's, there's several bullets the one in the front i would shoot there's at least one two three bulls. at least 20 20 deer or 20 elk right there there's three there's they're just feeding one they're coming up two there's three bulls steve Look at that one bugling in the back there, right behind that big should I, tree. Should we call him? What should we do? We We're get really exposed right now. Yeah, we get in these trees real easy. I don't think they see us. Let's let them relax a little. That is the biggest bull I've seen while hunting. Look at, he's got him cornered. I don't know. I think, I think we dip down. Maybe go up that way. Hold on. We need to... Do this right. Winds going, winds going this way. Look, so we need to go that way. That's what I'm saying. We, we need to go down here to, and then up. That's and, what I just said. And then, yeah, I'm thinking. <laughs> I don't listen to you. Still. You don't and listen then, to me. I know that. We need to go. I hope this camera can pick all that up. So we're taking a break. We're in about two and a half miles, I guess. Well, I've made some excellent burritos. Good stuff. Thank you, Sue. Yeah. So last night we, we saw them on this hill right here. But that group, there was probably a hundred, maybe 75 good bulls. This group we saw earlier that, you, that I showed you, there's only maybe about 25. So I don't know that it's the same group or not. But we're not sure. It's only about nine o'clock in the morning. We're not sure if we're gonna stick around here until dark when they come back out. Down below us, down here, there's a <clears throat> there's a creek river down there. We think they they go water down there. Then they bed up here in these trees. We saw them walking through these trees last night, right in front of us. And we're hoping that maybe we can catch some along here someplace. That group we saw in the field, we never got a hold of them. The wind was just howling back there. We couldn't figure out which way to go because the wind would change from direction to direction. So I don't think we blew them out, but you know, they were taking a break here. And I'm not sure what we're gonna do the rest of the day, but we'll take you along. Well, it's at the end of our first day. It's been a fun day. Chased up a lot of elk. It wasn't meant to be. This archery hunt is a whole different story. If, if we were rifle, we would limit it out this morning. But this is opening day. It's hot. Today down the valley is supposed to be 100 degrees. So up here it'll probably be in the high, mid to high 70s. So we'll try it again tomorrow morning and see how that goes. Appreciate you guys sticking around. We'll get one. More videos to come. Stick around. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Adios.